Lines are melodies and harmonies that not only tell the stories of the trans and non-binary community. For Tonality Choir member Sox Whitmore, it's an opportunity to use their own story to teach acceptance. Transgender issues are obviously affecting the transgender community, but the people we need to speak to are not our people. We need to speak to the world. Grammy-nominated and award-winning ensemble Tonality is known for delivering authentic stories through voice to incite change, understanding, and overall to start dialogue. We use the term trans awareness. Awareness is a great word, you know, we need awareness. But really, I think we, we need humanization. In their latest reprise concert, Just Me, Tonality sheds a light on the journeys and experiences of trans and non-binary folks. Sox uses this as an opportunity to humanize their community while honoring those lost to gender-based violence. According to the Human Rights Campaign, in 2022, at least 41 transgender and gender non-conforming people were violently killed. Sox says the pain in the community is often healed through the joy they feel when allowed to live their best authentic self. Alexander Lloyd Blake started Tonality in 2016. Music gives us an opportunity to hear stories in a different way. It's not like through the news or through statistics. It is more emotional and I think through that we find a sense of empathy. Over the years, Blake created a safe space and catalyst for social justice and community activism, taking the ensemble and their mission to new heights by collaborating alongside artists like Bjork and Kelly Clarkson. And with every melody, Blake and Sox hopes to raise visibility and acceptance of the trans and non-binary communities. We've created a space to honor, to celebrate, to appreciate, and to love trans people. A space where Sox can not only make change for their community, but a space where they can celebrate their true authentic self.